Hello everyone out there, greetings. Uh, I'm known as Side Pocket, by the way, if you didn't know. I'm one of the two co-founders of DCG201. Uh, we just want to get a couple of things out of the way before we get into the meat and potatoes of this because we really want to. We've been working on this for days now, uh, going through everything ever since we made a certain tweet that we're going to get into in a moment. Uh, so we're just really excited that we can finally broadcast this message out. And this is from all of us, uh, especially from me. Uh, a couple of things. First of all, uh, you see all the logos and branding down there. Um, we've been wanting to update those for over a year and a half now. And in the next two weeks, you're going to see new and different uh, iconography and branding. Uh, still going to be DCG 201. We're still under DEF CON groups. It's just going to be newer looking stuff. So... Just to note, uh, because we're recording this on April 1st, ironically enough, this is probably going to be some of the last times that uh, you will actually see this sort of logo stuff. We're going to have a whole new everything. Uh, two, as you probably noticed that the chat's disabled here. This is not a live stream. This is just our way of recording this and to make this official. Uh, we just wanted to get this whole thing out there. Third is that, uh, that if you see me squint and kind of pause awkwardly and everything, uh, I've had so much going on in my life. I lost my glasses uh, three or four weeks ago, and I'm prosecuting new ones. Uh, a bunch of us recently got our vaccinations and stuff. So if I squint and look like Mr. Magoo and sound awkward, that's why. I have a bunch of notes here to make sure that I don't screw up because I've, you know, it's side pocket. He always screws up, so I've already screwed up enough. I don't want to keep on screwing up. So if things just seem off, that's why, okay? And uh, last but not least... Um, let me just get up here. Okay. Yep. Is that, yes, we know this is April 1st, but we want to clarify, this is not an April Fool's joke. Okay. Uh, you will never hear us say April Fool's in this video. Uh, we know the timing is ironic and you will not hear us retract this statement from now or in the future. This is us being dead serious about this. So with that out of the way, you know us, we're from New Jersey. We're really blunt. So let's just get to the point and allow me one courtesy sip of water. So, there's my cursor. Here we go. You may have noticed that on our social media, we have been very vocal about multiple issues involving hacking and digital rights. I know, that's the understatement of the century. Uh, one of our most recent ones is our various uh, members disagreeing with the Free Software Foundation's decision to reinstitute uh, Richard Stallman onto their board without any transparency and all the fallout from that. That's a whole crazy topic. You've seen us get into it. You've seen other people get into it. That's, that's not what we're exactly here for. It does relate to this because recently uh, we made a post on our Twitter account that called out an individual known as Eli the Computer Guy. He's a tech YouTuber. You can go check him out on YouTube or NVIDIAs or FreeTube or whatever uh, client that you manage to watch YouTube videos on. And we were calling him out for his views. Um, in particular, we made a post attempting to let it be known, and this is what we were trying to communicate originally, that our organization does not want to be involved associate, or associated with any partnership or event going forward that involves Eli the Computer Guy. Why are we making this video? Well, it's kind of obvious, although what's obvious anymore? We sadly did not properly convey this message. That message was crass, inflammatory, reactionary, and caused way more problems than it solved. Not cool, not kosher. We made a mistake and we're sorry. We are deeply sorry about that. For those of you who don't know, uh, being co-founder of DCG201, I have two roles. All our members have different roles in the group. And one of those roles, and it's a huge role, is that I am in charge of and responsible for all the PR or public relations. Every single blog post you see from us, tweet, goofy meme, video, live stream, etc. I'm responsible for that. Even if other members do their own shows, uh, do their own posts, design that, does not matter who posts anything, whether it's good or bad, I'm the one responsible for it. We, and thus I, because I'm the one who's responsible for this, made a huge blunder on our social media. So we wanted to make a couple of points clear in this video, okay? One, as the primary hacker in charge for the public relations of DCG201, I do apologize for the crassness of the tweet to Mr. Eli and those of you who read it on our Twitter or on his YouTube video. For real, I mean that. 
me and other DCG201 members disagree with many of your points, uh, Mr. Eli, both personally along with the group, but our social media and as the representative of the social media for DCG201, we should not have used that language that we used. Again, it was crass. It was unhelpful. It was, it was just wrong. It was unnecessary. And I apologize to that to you, Mr. Eli. Okay, you got that? Good. And again, you don't have to accept our apology. We just want to make it known that we and I apologize for how we communicated that tweet. Again, crass and unnecessary. Two, this is just one person we're apologizing to, okay? This apology, this video we're making here and the post and all that across all of our stuff is aimed to our DCG 201 members and our fans, both locally and on the wide world of the internet out there. <laughs> we know how much you love our content and our hacks and our memes and fun live streams and our in-person meets when there's not a pandemic going around. And we love you for it too. That's why we love showing our appreciation, whether it's shouting out people's cool projects or giving out like cool trinkets and stuff. So I, and the rest of DCG201 believe that you deserve better, especially with regards to the quality control of our social media presence and all the types of posts that we made over the years. You folks are awesome. You deserve better than this. We completely agree with that. We want to apologize for you for those type of posts that you've had to put up with over the years. Three, we believe at DCG201 that it's the hacker way to learn and improve. We recently have made a post on our social media to form a positive way of expressing our frustration and your frustration and anger over the different types of tech issues out there, you know, ethical tech issues as well as mechanical tech issues. We want to continue this thread, such as our recent pinned post uh, that might be temporarily unpinned for this on our Twitter, as well as our other social media presence. Uh, we want to continue this thread to be constructive, not attacking, but constructive for all our future posts and content. We want to punch up, not down, and supporting our stance with guided opinions and not crash declarations and reactionary, inflammatory, and just bait-ridden shit posts. We're not doing that anymore. We, we are embarrassed of those type of posts, and we want to apologize for in the past making those posts. We are not doing that again. Four. And this is the last point we want to make, but definitely not least. We want to apologize to DEF CON, including the core DEF CON staff, and the other DEF CON groups who have suffered due to our words and actions over this and in the past. Okay? Uh, even though we are not, we are not poor core DEF CON, we are not DEF space CON, we are just uh, one of the many groups of these awesome umbrella organizations of these amazing awesome groups known as defcon groups or dcgs we are not core defcon staff and we continue to remind people of that but at the end of the day defcon itself has graciously allowed us to continue to use part of their namesake for our operations interesting factoid that's the primary reason why we are not completely copy left with all of our branding we can't because we, we don't own the DEF CON name. That's DEF CON owns that name. Mm -hmm. We do not want to misrepresent them or other groups. And they didn't tell us to say, this is on our own initiative. Uh, we feel that we left DEF CON and DEF CON groups down because of our inflammatory posts over the years. And we have learned from that. And we will do better. To reiterate, it is part of the hacker way to learn from our mistake, you know, to learn from our mistakes, analyze the problem, and build steps to rectify the issue. Uh, as the famous George Carlin once said, uh, it's not enough in blues to know what notes need to be played, you need to know why they need to be played. The first step to solving a problem is to acknowledge there's a problem. This video and our posts and everything that you see here today is us acknowledging that problem our screw up. We, we've seen firsthand in many cases, individually and as an organization, as DCG 201, 
uh, organizations that lack transparency, lack accountability, and treat bugs as if they're features. We are not. DCG201 is not. And we will not be that type of organization. We didn't want to be. We screwed up on that. And we definitely don't want to be that going forward. Yes, our members do critique the current hacker news and events, and having constructive criticism goes a long way. But as we said, you out there, all of you folks watching, all of you awesome hackers, deserve better than what we've been currently posting and serving up. And there are way better ways of doing it, and we want to do those better ways going forward. Now, all the stuff that I just said, and all the stuff if you read the post above all of that, those are just words. They're important words. They need to be said, but they're words. It is now up to us and our responsibility as DCG201 to prove those words to all of you and back up those words with our actions, publicly and privately going forward. To that point, we also want to put out that again, I'm responsible for R the PR. Doesn't matter who made any of those posts in the past or currently, I'm responsible for that PR. And so I just want to also let everyone know that of my own volition, as the ghost door slams, I, side pocket of DCG 201, am going to step down, hear me out, from doing all of our social media and PR going forward. I'm still going to be involved setting up the group and all that sort of stuff, you know, as co-founders do of and founders do of DEF CON groups. Uh, but uh, I'm we're going to hand the reins over to other group members. And a lot of them are really awesome. They are way better than I am. I can say that with a straight face. And I'm really excited to see all of the awesome positive content they're going to post going forward. I'm so I've been wanting this actually for months now, years. I'm so excited for that. And we're also excited for all the upcoming content, tech news, activism, live broadcasts, hopefully eventually in-person meetings after we all get vaccinated and get over this terrible hump in our United States and world history. And of course, the occasional funny memes that we like to post. Basically, after today with this post and video, you are going to see, honest to God, a new and improved DCG 201. And we also want to note if you have any questions or problems with the way that we act, like our Constitution says, if you have a problem with anyone, that includes with people in DCG 201, please let us know. We want to learn and rectify and move forward in a positive way. If we screw up, let us know. We appreciate that, and it's an honor to present all this type of stuff to you and to make a space for all of us to do cool hacks online or in person. So that's the big information we want to relay. Uh, I want to thank uh, DEF CON uh, itself, as well as DEF CON groups for sorting through stuff and helping us out, especially over the years. They've been a huge help. That's why we wanted to be part of DEF CON groups in the first place. And thank you all for taking out your time to watching this important message, reading this important message. Uh, stay safe out there. And of course, hack the planet. This is Side Pocket, co-founder of DCG201. And I will see you in the future with a new and improved DCG 201. Peace.